Hey guys, so it just feels like I just did a book review, but it is time for another one. And today's book is the sequel to last week's book, which today is Safe House by Tracy Hunter Abramson. And this is book two, To Fail Safe. And in this book, it is about the main character of Fail Safe's best friend, in a sense. And then it is another... They call them ghosts in the program, so it's another ghost in the program. And it kind of shows their journey, kind of. It shows their journey, and there is a go to figure out who's trying to take down the program that they are currently trying to protect, who's trying to, and who's trying to kill the main female lead in here. And I love how in her books, she really puts in the element of mystery and suspense in there. And I love how in this one, how she incorporated the other characters from her series, her Saint Squad series. She included those in this book here. And I love how her romance, because I have read several other mystery books that the romance really overpowers the story, and I think that ruins it. If I want a overpowering romance book, I'll go read one. But this one has the faint romance line, plus the character development, plus the mystery, plus the suspense, the intrigue. It literally kept me on the edge of my seat here. Like, she starts a chapter off, and then, like, she'll leave you hanging on that thought for a bit, and then she comes to another element in the story, another other characters, and then she leaves you on there and goes to other characters, and then Legion comes back. But they're all tied together. And that's her way of keeping you on the edge of your seat, I guess. So I was super excited when I saw that this came out. After reading Failsafe, I kind of went, I need a, a sequel to this. So, ooh, excuse me, so I was really glad when Safe House came out. And I l love how she talks about each character's develop, like their dilemma, and then at the end of the story how they have kind of discovered more about themselves and kind of become like the character journey to become better people in the end. And I love how she really, like I love her use of the descriptions in here. And how she intermingles the storyline together with each character. And how they intermingle together. And I love, like I said, I love how she's included characters from her other stories as well. And how she keeps things going with, like, the adventure, the intrigue, the mystery. You know, things like that. And that is why I love Tracy Hunter Abramson. And I was it got on her website that she has and saw that she's got a new book coming out April 1st, it says. And my sister went, oh, it's coming out April 1st, April Fool's Day. So she says, what if it's a joke? And I, I looked at her and I went, I hope it's not a joke. So, but that is my take on Safe House by Tracy Hunter Abramson. I hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you in Monday's video. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.